hello guys hello guys welcome back again to yet another video so today guys i've prepared something amazing something very beautiful for you many guys have been asking me to record seven once again in the qfc i only recorded one video and that i've noticed the one that it, it has a lot of views and so today i've prepared for you this song of uh, my job if you know it by De deborah lucal so the song i'm going to play it in the key of c <laughs> So basically, I'm not going to play the song from the start. I'm only playing it, uh, the climax part, because the goodness, the sweetness of seven it when you reach the climax part. The climax part for this song is when they reach Tunakwita Baba He Ten 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 Tunakwita Baba E Niwa Majapu. So uh, without uh, uh, wasting time, I just want to play off early, then I'll break it down for you. To simplify you if you're a beginner and intermediary this video is for you here it goes <laughs> So the song we're only playing two chords. We're only playing four and five. So if we could have played it simply without without uh, complicating it, we would have played like this: Do not quit, Baba E, four and five. Do not quit, Baba E. So my four in the key of C, my four it is F. One, two, three, four, F. If I play it in root position F, it will be F. In my left hand, I'll play F. Right hand, it will be F, A, and C. Then my second chord that I'm playing is G. It's my fifth chord. G, left hand, it will be G. Right hand, it will be G, B, D. So, do not quit, ba, ba, A, da, da, da. Do not quit, ba, ba, A, da, da, da. But instead of playing that, you can improvise. As I always say, the sweetness of improvising brings the sweetness of a song. So like the way I was starting. So four. This is my this is four in root position. So what about if you try to find the first inversion? It would be like this. So I started here. So I played something like this. This is the first inversion. This is F and first inversion. Then I went to my root position of G. So it was like this. Let me slow down the tempo. G. that F this is F in root position this is F first inversion so I start with F first inversion then I do something so I play F first inversion as simple as that whether you are a beginner intermediate only two chords F first inversion 
for the left hand because I know a lot of guys are waiting to see what I'm doing in my left hand. But left hand in seven is all it's all it's always about octaves. Whenever you are landing, when you are playing seven, it's always about octaves. So F. So the difference is that I'm doing D, 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 then this this is um, four octaves, this is F and F. I start with the higher F, then I land with the lower F. Then when I'm going to land to my next chord, which is G, I'm doing two and five. Two and five. When the key of C, C is our do. So do re, my re is two, two and five. So basically something like this. Whether you're a beginner, it's very simple for you. That part. So when they say do not quit ba ba e, you can decide to do here. It's the G chord, our our second chord. You can either do in this G chord. This is G in root position. If we move our fingers one by one, we play the first inversion. It sounds so nice when you when you do like da 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 when it's in the first inversion. I like when it's in the root position. When you play the first in inversion, it's like you're emphasizing upon that note that uh, it, it's, it's like emphasizing basically what the soloist is trying to say. Let me play with a beat. And so, for advanced and intermediaries, your left hand base, as you can notice, it has changed a bit. For beginners, that was the first. Uh, the first bass which you can play for for advanced and intermediaries you can play something like this see that so we start with octave f and f octave so after doing the octaves we emphasize with that C. D, 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 D. You see that? D, 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 D.
you can be playing. The secret in seven is always about playing. This is the secret I know most pianists and most pianists who play seven perfectly. They never like to share. But the secret, and I'm about to release it to the world today, is always about playing with the root inversion and second inversion. Once you master the secret of playing with the root, first inversion, second inversion, you have mastered seven. Like the way I, I was uh, uh, I was melodizing, like this way. Starting in F, uh, you can even start in, in F root position. You see F. This is F root position. Then you go to root first inversion. So it is like this is G root position. Root position. First inversion. Second inversion. This is a leaked video. I, I wasn't supposed to share this message, but simply because you have subscribed, this is the secret to seven inversions. This is the secret. So, the, uh, one more time as I wonder. Bye-bye.